Okay, in this video we're going to look at how to resize the design using Wolfram's True Sizer. This is version 2.0 and it's quite simple really. It's just Control A or Edit, select all and you can see the Control A there. So you can see it's selected and then simply grab the handles and reduce it down. Before we do that, you'll see that the stitch count is 29,223 and this is the size. So we'll look at another way of changing this design design size shortly but we just drag it down you can see the size has come down and so has the stitch count conversely we could come here and say well we know we want it to be 100 millimeters wide let's reduce the, the width to 58.97 of the original so let's make the height the same percentage reduction to keep it in proportion now one thing that you need to be careful of and be aware of is that when you reduce a design down too much um, there could be some elements that won't work for example you know you've got a, a satin stitch here that just may be too narrow to stitch so if this true sizer will resize EMB files and recalculate the stitch count but there may be some elements that won't work so well uh, there is of course a limit to how small or large you can make any design. If you made the other way and you made the satin stitch so large that it might have been 10 millimeters across, well that's not going to work either. 